Hey everybody, Rick Needham Handicapping Thoroughbred Racing on Sunday afternoon, July the 3rd, and this is my Equibase Winter Circle East Coast Racing Report. Let's go to Belmont Park for their featured race 9 today, 5.17 p.m. Eastern Post Time. This is the Better Roses Stakes, 7 for a long sprint on the dirt track, grade 3. Phillies and Mares, 3 years old and up, racing for $150,000. Contenders number 6, Ildis Passion, number 3, Karmic Comic Marvel, number one, Kid Kate, and number seven, Christine Day. For you folks who enjoy a little thoroughbred racing history to accompany your handicapping efforts this afternoon, uh, the Better Roses Handicap was named after Alfred G. Vanderbilt's champion juvenile filly of 1949 and handicap mare champion of 1952. She was named to Thoroughbred Racing's Hall of Fame in Saratoga in 1976. Here in the 55th edition of this graded stakes event, number six, Hilda's Passion, takes a slight class drop, will enjoy a substantial speed and pace profile advantage on this field. She's hit the board in power run fashion in five straight, winning three times in this recent streak of racing consistency. Jockey Javier Castellano has been in her arms on five, excuse me, six previous occasions, hitting the board in each, winning four times. Back today for ride number seven. The 15 to 1 bomb number three comic marble is posted a pair of circle trips in her last five starts. Race nine summary number six, Hilda's Passion, tops my contenders list, which also includes number three, Comic Marvel, number one, Kid Cade, and number seven, Christine Day, 63179 from Belmont Park, the $150,000 grade three better roses stakes. Let's go to Kentucky's Churchill Downs for race 5, 2.51 p.m. Eastern Post Time. That's a nine furlong route test on the turf. Three year olds and up race for a claiming purse of $45,500. Contenders number seven, Thabismi. Number two, Monte <laughs> Monzante. Number three, Pick a Pocket. And number one, Hidden Glance. Number seven, Thabinsby. I have absolutely no idea, folks, how to pronounce the name of this horse. A four-to-one shot. Pace profile leader in this claiming field. Racing at or about today's distance of nine furlongs on the turf. This hit the board in four straight, including back-to-back -back power run wins in his last two starts. Number two, Monzante. Drops in class by six units. Comes off a power run show finish facing better company his last time out. Race five summary. On top of my list is the unpronounceable number seven, Tha Baz Imbi. Number two, Monzante. Number three, Pick a Pocket. And number one, Hidden Glance. Seven, two, three, one. And the fifth from Churchill Downs. Bonus long shots. Parks Racing. Ben Salem, PA. I still think it should be called Philadelphia Park. Race three, the five to one shot. Number eight, one of the best. The overall speed leader in this claiming field. It's posted a trio of power run board hits in this last five starts. Prairie Meadows in Iowa, race three. Number six, Shaw Call Addiction, eight to one in the morning line, drops in class by three units. Nice overall speed for this mile test on the dirt. So handicapping on a Sunday afternoon from both Belmont Park and Churchill Downs, Rick Needham for the Equibase Winter Circle, reminding you as always to please bet with your head, not over it.